Hi everybody and welcome to today's Diesel Doozy. DieselDoozy.com How to and do it yourself. Today we are going to replace the hard drive in a MacBook computer. These are the tools you will need to perform the hard drive replacement. A small Phillips head screwdriver, a T8 Torx screwdriver, and a coin to open the battery top. The first thing you will want to do is remove power from the computer. Before proceeding, you will want to discharge any static electricity you have on your body. Now, close the computer. Flip the computer over on its back. Now, using the coin, remove the battery. Stick the coin in the lock. Rotate the lock clockwise. And the battery pops up. Now simply lift up on the battery and pull it toward you. And the battery is now removed. Now that the battery is removed, you need to remove three screws. They are right here, here, and here. And you will use the Phillips head screwdriver to do this. Once the screws are removed, carefully remove the bezel. This bezel here, the screws are still in the bezel. Be careful not to lose these screws. Take the bezel and set it in a convenient location. Now it is time to extract the hard drive from the computer. These two slots right here are for memory. You will find the hard drive right here under the battery latch. Removing the hard drive is very simple. Pull this tab out, firmly grasp the tab, pull firmly but gently until the hard drive comes loose. Gently slide the hard drive out of the computer. Now that you have the hard drive assembly out of the computer, you need to free the hard drive from the sled. This is where you will need your T8 Torx screwdriver, preferably with a magnetic head so you do not lose the screws. Remove the screws one at a time. Once you have removed the screws and put them in a safe place, now remove the hard drive from the aluminum sled. The hard drive is now removed from the computer. Now we will install the new hard drive. Before you touch the new hard drive, discharge any static electricity from yourself. Now take the new hard drive, remove it from the protective bag. Dispose of the silica gel. Do not eat this. It is not candy. Remove the hard drive from the bag. Now retrieve the T8 screws. Put them in a convenient location, such as right on the computer where they won't get lost. Install the hard drive in the sled, making sure you line up the screw holes in the hard drive with the screw holes on the sled. Now install the screws one by one. Using your T8 screwdriver, tighten the screws down.
again, if you have a magnetic screwdriver, this makes life a lot easier. If we can get the camera to focus here, there we go. Stick the screwdriver, the screw on the screw head, it's magnetic. And then put the screw in the hole. And then screw it. Do not over tighten. If you see a kink or something, simply loosen the screw, flatten out the kink, and retighten it. Now it is time to install the hard drive into the computer. Once in the sled, to install the hard drive in the computer, take the hard drive, drive side down, careful not to touch this area, and slide it into the computer like this. It should slide right in. Take the flap, tuck it underneath the drive, firmly press the hard drive into place. You don't want it sticking out. Now take the hard drive slash memory cover bezel and reinstall it. Again, careful not to lose these screws. Take your Phillips head screwdriver and tighten the screws. Do not over tighten. Take the MacBook's battery, reinstall the battery. Using the coin, lock the battery in place. You have now installed the hard drive in your MacBook computer. Thank you for watching. That's it.